Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer called for new elections in Israel to replace Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu, marking the most significant public criticism of the Israeli government by a U.S. leader since Israel's war against Hamas began. Prime Minister Netanyahu has lost his way by allowing his political survival to take the precedence over the best interests of Israel. Schumer, the highest ranking Jewish official in the U.S., made the call during remarks on the Senate floor, citing the need for change in Israeli leadership. He expressed support for a temporary ceasefire between Israel and Hamas, but opposed a permanent one, arguing it would allow Hamas to regroup. Earlier this week, in a separate incident, tensions escalated as a very senior Israeli official criticized a U.S. intelligence report suggesting Netanyahu government's viability might be in jeopardy. The report anticipated large protests demanding Netanyahu's resignation and new elections. In response, Netanyahu vowed to win the ongoing conflict with Hamas and emphasized the overwhelming support from the American people and Congress. On Tuesday, U.S. National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan responded to reports that the U.S. was considering withholding aid to Israel if it moves forward with a ground offensive in Rafah. He denied the report, stating they were uninformed speculation. But he did stress the importance of avoiding civilian casualties in any Israeli operation. Thank you.